a new briar is here and in today's video we are going to be doing a pre briar fest updated collection tour i know the briar fest is literally a month away but i am not planning on getting any beans until briar fest so my collection will most likely stay exactly like this until briar fest unless i do some virtual clarion purchases which is highly likely and i already do have a few briar fest clarion beans here which you're gonna see i don't have any ponies in the mail right now because like I just said I'm not planning on buying any more horses until Briarfest but y'all are going to see that I have sold off more horses because I'm trying to get space and then also I have some plans for the other horses that I've sold off so it's all in the works all right y'all without any further ado let's dive right in all right so I'm pretty sure we know the drill with these collection tours but first I'm gonna start out with my main shelving unit and then just kind of work my way around my room because I do have ponies literally everywhere I do have some beans that are actually out in our game room where I have my workspace so they will not be in this video but almost everyone is gonna be in this all right let's do it all right, we are gonna start out at the very top. So over here, we've got Donut, Star-Lord. Oh, no, I forgot their names. That's okay, some unicorns, and then Chewbacca, and then right up there is Sassy Bean. Right here, we have Winter Wonderland, who is waiting on a metal stand because he fell over and like spiderweb cracked his stand. So it's really scaring me, but he's got a new stand on the way. Over here is part of my Ethereal Conga. So right there, we've got Keith, Zuko, Finn, AKA, UNSC Infinity and Ahsoka. I must have forgotten to put H. Lake Horse on their shelf, which is, you know, I guess I do that sometimes, so that's okay. As we turn the corner, we've got Cloud, aka Cloud9, Fabio, who does need a new name, Bugatti and Ty, aka Tuxedo Junction, and some heck of fancy Shalake beans. Moving on to the shelf, we have one of my Briarfest purchases so far. This is Harmony. I cannot remember the name that I gave him. I think it was like, uh, uh, yeah, okay, we're gonna move on because I don't remember. Right here we have Stark, aka Tony Stark. Here are Hera and Hercules, and then right there I have Obi-Wan, aka Obi-Wan Kenobi, and one of my all-time favorite Schlake Pegasuses up front. As we turn the corner, we come onto one of my absolute favorite shelves. This is my bunny conga, which I am shook that I have a conga on this mold. Here we have Bumper, aka Double Trouble. This is Hella Bear. AKA Ursa Major. And here we have Kicker. And then up in the front, we've got a super chunky little Schlake boy who matches them. So he gets to chill on the shelf with them. Chilling in his own little cube, we've got Bethlehem and my Glitter Light Fury Pop figure. And moving on to his shelf neighbors, we have Drummer Boy, Jorg, Alamo, AKA Remember the Alamo, and Falcon, AKA Millennium Falcon, with Titan, the heck of fancy Schlake boy from my new Schlake series, which does need a series name. Oh, finally we're at a decent height shelf so I don't have to reach. Here we have Altea. I know that it's kind of a girly name so I don't know if I'm gonna change it for him, but I kind of wanted to name him after a planet so if anybody has any better ideas, please let me know. Here we have Asher, aka Fallen Angel, Andromeda, aka Andromeda Galaxy, and this is Spitfire, another Briarfest bean that will be in my Briarfest. Fest Hall and the iconic Bob. Oh my goodness, I love Bob. By far, my favorite spot on my shelving unit is my catcher custom, which has a trophy and a plate that we won together, and also my old catcher bracelet and my toothless pop figure. Moving on over here, we have the Othello family. I think I might move them back over there and those guys over here, but I haven't fully decided yet. Here we have Apollo, aka Mission Apollo, also known as the King Bean himself. Here we have Pan Pandora, aka Pandora's Box, Hades, Eros, and Athena. And then up in the front is Chubbs. Moving on to my Smarty Jones conga, we have Hakan, Playboy, Kenway, aka Edward Kenway, and Chicken Nugget, plus a super fancy Schlick Alicorn. Moving on to the big boy shelf, we got Han, aka Han Solo, and Latigo, who does need a new name. If you have any name suggestions, comment them down below, because I have a lot of beans that need new names. Here we have Samson and Truffles and a super cute pink Schlake unicorn. Moving over here. Wait, Sith and Milo aren't here. Ah, that's because I'm actually getting designer horses to replace 
them. Sith was absolutely body quality and it really bothered me and also Milo. Yeah, he had some issues. I'm going to be getting designer horses to replace them so those hopefully will be done in the next maybe three months. I don't really know but Sith and Milo are just kind of getting an update so hopefully they'll look a little bit better this time around. All right, moving on. Here we have Maul and Antake and then right here is another Briarfest purchase. This is Hoth who is my winter. I have wanted this guy for so long so the fact that I was able to find him in like LSQ condition is insane. And then here we have Thor. But we can't forget about the two donkeys in the front. That's Carol and Glenn. Uh, you know what? Every single time I give this girl a name I forget it so there's no name. Here we have Hamilton aka Alexander Hamilton, Arthur aka King Arthur, Mars aka Skizzy Mars, and Rico. Plus Fantasia who is keeping all of the boys in line. Moving on down to the shelf below we have my very small Morgan Kaga now. Wow. Here we have Reaper aka Dust Lord, Twix aka The Greatest Snack, and Genji aka Prince of Dragons. Chilling with them we got Anakin aka Anakin Skywalker and Clyde. The next Christmas bean that we have is mistletoe with my favorite nightlight. Ah, so cute. Over here is Lakota, Kylo, aka Kylo Ren, Simmons, and hmm, did I get that guy a name? I don't think I did. Plus two super adorable little llamas. Gasp! This conga got so much smaller. Just kidding. They're actually scattered everywhere. I tend not to keep my congas fully together anymore. That's where the others are. Here we have Lasky, aka Commander Lasky, Romeo. Here we have Lotor. And then this adorable Marin full set would be Palomo and South, aka South Dakota. Plus Chupaca. Moving on down here, this is the majority of my Othello conga. But first, we gotta acknowledge the two tiny Schlake boys. Here we have Ezio, aka Ezio Auditori, Ragnarok, Asgard, and Gaston. Turning the corner, this guy does not have a name yet. I have been on the name dilemma for a while, so yeah, I got a lot of beans that need names, plus help. Here we have Luke, aka Luke Skywalker, another small alpaca. Here we have Ewok and Jin, aka Jin Urso. And then right here, we've got Nitro, aka Nitro Circus. Oh, yes, Noel, my very first Christmas bean. Yes, a true OG. We stan. Here we have Irish, aka Luck of the Irish, and his best friend Oliver. Right here we've got Kathawari and Wrecker, aka Wrecking Ball. And yes, a very fancy boy. Ah, the very last row, and then we're done with the main shelving unit. Here we have Tucker, Butter, aka Buttercream, Church, Padme, and Skywalker, and then right there is Yoda, the llama. In his own little cube, we got tinsel. Look at how adorable that little Schlick custom is. Right here we got Bukafellos and his mom Uni and then Shadow aka Shadow Chaser and his mom Zenyatta and then there's Syrup aka Maple Syrup. On the very last shelf we have Bubbles, Hopper aka Jim Hopper, Sanders and Toast aka Champagne Toast with another Schlick custom. Alright so that concludes who's on my main shelving unit. Now we just gotta go around the rest of my room to see the other beans. Chilling in their newly redone barn, we got Jedi and Loki, plus Dr. Spots. We can't forget about that little tiny bean. Over on my dresser, I have my voyeur jumping over my infinity jump. I renamed this guy Superman. And then here is my very first stablemate shelving unit. Now, most of my stablemates do not have names, so I won't be saying them. But if y'all are curious about what these shelves are, they're actually shot glass shelves that I got off of Etsy. They were worth the money because now I don't have to worry about my stablemates falling over all the time. And they're customizable, which is amazing. And then the last place that I have horses in my room would be my ladder bookcase. So up top we've got some from my OG herd. My mom owned these when she was a kid and she gave them to me before I started collecting. So this is Snowflake. That's Stormy and Misty. Here we have Acer and Blizzard. Right here we've got Mariah's Boone who does need a new name. I have not thought of a new one. He is a part of my Briarfest haul so far. I'm so excited to finally have this guy. And then the very very last bean to finish off this collection tour is Cosmo. All right, y'all, so that's actually gonna be the end of today's YouTube video. Thank you.
you so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed. And if you did, please go slap the bell like button as hard as you possibly can to show this YouTube video and my beans a little bit of love. Also, if you're feeling exotic, please don't forget to check out my Instagram account, which is at infinity underscore briars. I post on there daily and I'm super active. Plus, you get to see photos of all my beans and who doesn't love that? Feel free to comment in the comment section down below which horse out of my entire collection is your favorite so I know who y'all want to see more because I have my personal favorites that I use all of the time but I want to make sure that y'all get to see some of your favorite beans so let me know. <laughs> Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you never miss out on an upload and other than that y'all, I'll see you in my next YouTube video. Bye!